Welcome everybody to a new mini vlog series where in the next few episodes I'm going to take my own car through a transformation. This is my car. It's a 1994 E36 BMW 325i manual, something I'm really proud of. So in this first episode, that's what we're going to do to the car. I just got these from a Yahoo auction in Japan. Uh, got it shipped over all in 1,600. These are lightweight BBS RK wheels. So just to give you an idea of what to expect in this episode, we're going to take these set of wheels down to Shah Alam, the king of rims, to get them refurbished because obviously they're really old rims, really used rims. So they're a bit scuffed up, the paint is a bit faded. So we're going to get them refurbished. I'm going to walk you through the entire process uh, as much as possible. And once it's done, we're going to wrap them up in Goodyear Asymmetric 5 tyres. And at the end of it, uh, perhaps I'll give you an impression of how the tyres and these lightweight wheels feel. But we're not going to carry these wheels in this. But instead, we're going to carry it in that. That's the BMW M850i X-Drive. And since it's a Grand Tourer with a rather large boot, let's try out the boot capacity. It looks like it wouldn't fit unless I flatten the seats, then it'll go all the way in, which is perfect. Layered. Don't say I abuse the car. Boots are meant for carrying things. And there. 4 17-inch rims in an 850i. I'm really tired. Alright, let's go! So right now they're checking the condition of the wheels to see which one is bent, uh, which one is in good condition before they can start work on it. So we got Jeff here. Uh, yeah, yeah. He's gonna walk us through what's gonna be done to those wheels. So, for starters, what are we gonna do? Okay, so what we're gonna do is that uh, to understand what kind of wheels is this. Right. Is, um, this is actually a BBS RK, one of the how say very rare rims. So these rims are magnesium alloy, so it's quite lightweight. Yeah, but yeah. You can see on the surface of the rims that uh, right. the previous a lot of brick dust uh, stick okay. onto this. This is actually what happened that if you don't clean up the wheels right. uh, often, right. so when the, you see this, the brick dust actually stick onto the the rims, and it's just very hard to scrape it off. Mm -hmm. So what we need to do right now, we need to sand it off. Uh, okay. uh, send it out as much as we can, um, smooth okay. out the surface then before we do the, the preparation for the rims. Right. Uh. But as yeah, so you can see that a lot of scratches on the edges. Yeah, this is actually yeah. happen is that when you when you park too close to the divider, uh -huh. all this actually happen. So before so, we but do does it, this actually affect the, the integrity of the rims? Uh, uh, so it's speak. not not really the quality because, because all this is actually just a how to say the cosmetic the damages right. is actually it's okay. not not really that bad though. Okay. But the when you talk about the integrity uh, damage will be those like maybe serious dents or some okay. crack. crack. Okay. Uh, the crack on rims to me, I really, I really don't recommend you, okay. you do it again. So just when you, the rim crack, I just suggest you just change it out because okay. it's, it's, it's too much hassle to repair okay. them. Okay. So, uh, but this all these rims are checked. There's no 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 serious damage. Okay. So uh, the only thing that is actually the, all the scratches, all this right. can be patched by using a, a what we call a filler, a, a cement. Right. So once right. my guy clean it off. Send okay. it off nicely. Right. Then we we'll try to patch it up with all the speed cement, make it smooth. Okay. Then before that we process it and then we spray onto the, the surface. We always do here and here as well, one shot. Okay. Make, make okay. the, the wick everything is very very nice. Okay. Oh, look. Good. Nice one, Jeff. Man. Thanks, man. Oh, really look, hooked me up. Yeah, it, it's, it's gonna look so original. Good. After this, man. This nice. brand new caps. Very very nice. Thanks, yeah. it. Thanks. Thank you so much. It's one down, three to go. One of the rims has been sprayed and it's sitting in there now, baking. It's gonna be in there for something like uh, 30 minutes to two hours. And once that's done, we're gonna come back in a couple of days and slap on those Goodyear Asymmetric 5 tires. We'll also be doing a separate video 
to review those tyres and tell you how they respond on the road in terms of the quietness, performance, handling and all that. So while we're waiting, I thought we'd come and check out the King's inventory. Check it out, it's just rims upon rims upon rims upon rims. And this is just one side. There's another side as well. Just racks and racks of rims. If you can't find one set of rims here that you like, it's not the shop's problem, it's your problem. The car is just in the center of attention here. Everyone is looking, taking pictures with their kids. And you have one X5 there, the brand new X5. And he's already got those wheels changed. Even he was staring at the car. So it's been a few days now and I've been told that my BBS RK rims are now done. So I'm back here at King of Rims. Check it out. Check it out, here they are. My goodness, they look completely different from when I last saw them. Oh. All the uh, scuff marks are all gone, obviously. I got new hubcaps as well. New valve covers. With the BBS engraving on it. Oh man. So these will be the tires that will be going on to those rims over there. Before I put them on, let's just go through a bit of these new tires. These are Goodyear Asymmetric 5 Eagle F1s. 225, 45, 17 in size. We're not gonna go through too much with the tires, uh, but I will touch a few features on this new tire. Three things to note, it comes with the active braking technology where the compound actually expands its surface, its contact surface on the road under heavy braking so as to give you better traction, better braking performance. And it also comes with this power cushion technology and impulse control compound technology where basically the tires will not flex too much under heavy braking or hard cornering to give you better control. I was also told that it comes with some sort of rim protection technology so that you wouldn't scuff your rims. Another thing about this rim compared to the previous Asymmetric 3 is that Goodyear says that it's 50% more quiet than before. I've had some experience with the previous Asymmetric 3 and I thought it was already very quiet so I can't wait to check out what this will be like. So, without further ado, let's get them on and check out the final product. So we're just doing some balancing work for the wheels. As you can tell from the laser there, it's going to add on some weights onto the wheels, making sure that it rolls nice and straight and not like that. Bye bye old fond metal, you will be missed, but not very often. <laughs> So the new rims are on the car now, it's still on the hoist but as you can tell it looks nothing like before and I'm truly truly satisfied with the work that they've done refurbishing it. It looks nothing like the rim that I left off and I'm really really satisfied. So the BBS RK lightweight wheels are now on my car and that's how it looks like. And you must be wondering what's the big deal about these lightweight wheels? What's the benefit of lightweight wheels in general? Well. I guess I can point out two things. One is because it's lighter, you have less unsprung weight. And when you have less unsprung weight, your suspension is not overly burdened. It allows it to work a lot better, giving you better handling, better road holding. And then the other thing is rotational mass. So with heavier wheels, you need more power. You're wasting more power to rotate the wheels. When it's lighter, power gets transferred to the road much more efficiently. So I was just browsing around their gallery and look who I ran into. That's Jeff. Uh, he runs this place along with his brother Lucas. So Jeff, I'm quite curious after all that's said and done, who is the king of rings? Oh, it's uh, us. We are king of rings. Right, yeah. this is your kingdom. Yes, yeah, this is our place, <laughs> our, our, our man's heaven. Oh, <laughs> man's heaven. When you come here, you, you know, look like a 
a, a, small, a small boy cup go into the Toys R Us. Right, store. kid in the candy like store. Yes, right, uh, okay, yes, okay. Yes, 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 yes. Why King of Rain? Uh, we have uh, over few thousand set of sport rims over here. Right. So as you know, uh, the, the quickest way to change the, the car's appearance to make yeah. it so much more nicer yeah. is by changing sport rims. Okay. So from a small rims to yeah. a bigger rims, your car you instantly looks so much more different. Okay. So yeah. you have new rims, old rims, tires, tires. Uh, where are all these rims from, like primarily? Okay, most of them will be uh, from Taiwan. Okay. So we have some Thailand, so of course okay. we have some other imported rims, like okay. maybe from Italy, so or right. US, or even Germany, so wow. we have a lot of them. Okay. So, yeah. so aside from providing rims to change the aesthetics of the car, yeah. what kind of services do you provide around here? Because like it's a massive premise. Yeah, it seems do. like there's a lot of different things going on here. Yeah, there's a lot of things we do. We, yeah. do, we, we do primarily rims and tires. Okay. Uh, we, we supply rims and tires for uh, for normal cars or even 4 by 4s We we okay. have them. But other okay. than this, we do uh, do services as well. Right. We do uh, a lot of uh, the, the car engine oil service and exhaust right. everything. Right. Basically, all the car repairs. Right. Uh, we, we do it as well. General car maintenance. General car maintenance. Yes. Okay. What about like body work? Uh, body work. We just yes, do it as well. We okay. have a few panels. Uh, okay. Insurance panels. So we do repair. Right, and right. Car painting and everything, and then yes, by uh, I also do a lot of spray wings and everything. So right, right. Okay, yeah. okay. Yeah. So, King, <laughs> can you show us your most expensive rim or one of the most expensive rims that you have around okay, here? One, uh, a few, a few branded rims like yeah. Chinese will be one of the right. one of the most uh, premium brand. Okay. All these rims you are talking about uh, really those uh, custom Porsche rims are uh, right. just we are talking about maybe forty or forty to fifty or thousand. What? <laughs> yes. One set. set. But okay. But don't don't be surprised about the price because yeah. that those rims are when you talk about twenty inches, so yeah. you can actually lift it up with one hand. The, right. Those rims are will really, uh, be weight less than maybe ten kilo per piece. Okay. That's very very That's impressive. very when very you have impressive. This kind of rims, uh, because all these okay. rims are usually are custom rims. Uh. Right. You have this, all these rims put on the car. Yeah. It's really really custom for your car. Okay. You look at it, I see. So so, so damn sexy. Uh, right. Yeah, right. So, Okay. I try cool. one of them and then Mostiner will be one of them. Mostiner, Mostiner right. Well, one of the most expensive things, yeah. uh, what, what we do offer. Of course, BBS as well. Okay. So, uh, these are the few brands which is we, we do offer as well. And then Enkai, Japan. Right. Uh, Enkai, we do have Enkai from Japan as well. All this. Uh, Ozek from Italy. Right. Um, yeah. These are really sought after yeah, wheels, my god. RPF one, RPF super one. light wheels. Super light wheels and then yeah. the is uh, Zinian M. Yeah, yeah. Inkai, Inkai, RS, Wokai, uh, okay. Very nice. And of course, okay. race as well. Race, yeah, right. Race as well. All this rim, oh. yeah, yeah. Have you, have you? Premium. Yeah, show us, show us, show us. <laughs> okay. No way. Let me have a feel. Yo, one hand, man. I mean, I'm not the strongest guy here, but yeah. Yeah, not, not, not bad. Not and that's a what, 20 inch wheel? Uh, no, it's 19 inch. Okay. 19 inch wheels but, uh, you're carrying last, in one hand. Uh, the last I weighed around 9 kilos. Wow. Okay. Very good. Well, so, yeah. so that's all I guess. Uh, check their place out. I mean, even if you're not doing any particular service at all, honestly, you can spend at least half an hour here without getting bored. There's so many rims here. You can keep yourself and pretty much entertained. If, if, if you're looking for rims and anything, so right. we have, uh, especially all those special cars, we have uh, right. four by fours, we have right. uh, BMW Mercedes, or okay. any, anything you're looking for. Are you yeah. anything rims you're looking for? Yeah. We probably have a lot of things. For yeah. You. I saw a customer coming to change like their SUV rims, their pickup rims. You seem to have everything. Yeah. Okay. Right. So King of Rims, uh, section thirteen. Section fifteen. Shah. Section fifteen. Shah Alam, Shah. Jeff, and. The other guy, Lucas. Yeah. Keep a lookout for these guys. Right. I'll see you in the next video where I will be touching a bit on the car's body but not in the way that you think. To find out, check out the next video. See you soon. Bye.